I'm John McDonough, I'm Associate Professor of Property Studies here at Lincoln and I teach the, uh, the property courses uh, at the University. Everything we do in our daily life involves property in some way or another, so the, unit, the building we're in right now uh, at the University, it needs management, it needs, it needs to have been designed and built and uh, contractors employed to uh, arrange its uh, delivery, um, and, um, but then you live at home, I mean you, how did that house get there, who did the development, you go shopping, uh, uh, who runs the supermarket, who runs the shopping centre, uh, all of these things are property. You learn everything you need to do to start a career at Lincoln, and so uh, typically what would happen is when you, when you graduate you go into a sort of an entry level position and you might be negotiating leases, uh, you might be um, uh, supervising maintenance, uh, these sorts of things, these are sort of entry sort of level positions and you, we'll have taught you how to do budgeting, we'll have taught you the essential elements of leases, these sorts of things and then as you uh, build up experience uh, on the job you probably get greater levels of, of, of responsibility and, and ultimately might be involved in, in designing and developing you know a, an entire university campus or, or a, a large office building. Uh, we've got some of our former students who manage you know billion dollar portfolios uh, so, um, but you don't expect to do that straight out of university, but one of the great things uh, is that there's more demand for our uh, students uh, or graduates than there is uh, jobs out there, so uh, we've got a, a very good uh, uh, history of being able to place people in jobs uh, immediately on graduation. We've got a very good reputation, we are accredited with the, all the professional uh, bodies in New Zealand, the uh, uh, Institute of Values, the Property Institute of New Zealand. Uh, and also we're accredited with the Royal Institution of Chartered Surveyors. That's a worldwide organisation and so with an RICS accredited degree you can basically work anywhere in the world in the property industry and so that's a major, a major attraction to students who might sort of say well I'd like to travel and they can travel and take their, their uh, professional accreditation with them. Another interesting thing about the uh, degree at Lincoln is that we've got this concept where you can do property plus uh, focus on another area uh, that's of interest to you. So instead of just being a, a straight three year degree, we now have a four year program and you can do property plus uh, accounting or you can do property plus environmental management. Uh, you can do property uh, plus GIS or geometics. So you can add basically another string to your bow. Um, and so there's, there's a whole range of, of options for students to sort of add on to a property degree. You'll still be professionally qualified, but you'll have this extra area of qualification. And another variation of this is, the, uh, is what we call our sort of international experience. And so you can actually spend a year or a semester at a university overseas and incorporate that within, uh, within your degree. So that's another great uh, uh, component of the Property Plus uh, approach. It's actually amazing where, where, where students have ended up and um, uh, just uh, one example I was talking about to somebody earlier on today, a former student, he, he at one stage was working in Afghanistan building um, uh, tilt slab uh, with concrete basically, tilt slab uh, uh, food storage warehouses. Uh, uh, after that he's actually ended up uh, working in the largest building in the world which is the um, uh, Dubai airport and he's in charge of all the sort of food related uh, uh, operations in that building, which is hundreds. Um, we've had other students who've worked in very strange places, uh, managing property for the Navy. It's not one of the places you'd sort of think about as having a, a property component, but they've got the Devonport Naval Base uh, to look after. We've had people working for local authorities, uh, uh, for universities, um, plus the sort of traditional areas, managing office buildings, um, managing uh, shopping centres, a very, a very, a very a popular area for some people who, who like retail. So in Christchurch, Rickard and Mall, uh, previously managed by one of our former students, uh, uh, Eastgate Mall, another one. So there's lots of opportunities to, to go in lots of different directions.